Hey nerds, it's Tiri. Welcome back to my show. So if you see me start to slowly drift this way, it's because of my new chair. I don't know what's happening. Plus if the camera shakes, I'm sorry. The back hits. We're gonna see how this chair thing works. Anyways, I've talked to you guys about the Timeless Isle coming in World of Warcraft patch 5.4. It's a new questing zone, a place where you can collect timeless coins and use them to purchase gear and such. One thing I don't think I've mentioned is they're gonna have weekly pet tournaments where you can go and test your pet battling skills against unique pet trainers. Check it out in the PTR right now. World of Warcraft's public test realm patch notes from July 18th and hotfixes from July 23rd will be linked in the description. Some sweet new products by Blizzard were announced at Comic-Con in San Diego this last week. If you go to the link below, you can see all of them, but right here, it's a pretty cool Jim Rayner figure from StarCraft, and their sweet new Sarah Kerrigan statue, also from StarCraft, which is fighting for first place on my favorites list against Deathwing, their sweet Deathwing statue from World of Warcraft. So click the link below if you wanna see the full list of new products announced at Comic-Con. It has recently been announced that Blizzard is planning on allowing people to queue up for multiple raids at a time coming in patch 5.4. So you basically just get into whichever one fills up first, which is fantastic, especially for the DPS that have to wait for over an hour and all the crying healers that don't have an instant queue anymore. I was pretty intrigued by the new Frost Mage Mastery coming in patch 5.4. 12% of the damage done by your Frost Bolt, Frost Fire Bolt, and Water Elemental's Water Bolt is stored up as an icicle with you for 15 seconds. You can store up to five of them and then when you cast ice lands shoots the icicles at the enemy yep those that went to comic-con got a teaser for blizzard's warcraft movie that they're working on kind of in the background it was very short and there aren't any clips of it up on the internet yet so you know if you like recorded it with your phone or something put a jank ball video on the internet and you can be the first by the time i upload this video they might have somebody might have uploaded one but it's whatever apparently the clip is of a human walking on unknown territory, comes across a skeleton, proceeds to loot his shield, takes a drink, and then an orc charges him, or something like that. Some, something like that. I, did, I didn't get to see it. I'm reading articles here. Bear with me. If you're interested in the new game Hearthstone that Blizzard is working on, combination of MMO and card game, Check out the link below to see the live stream Friday, July 26th, where they're gonna talk about what's going on, current things that they're working on, and new things that you may not know about. Stream starts at 10 a.m. and you can also catch the embedded video in the other link if you miss the live stream. Well, that is my show for today. Thank you so much for watching. Today's video is a little bit short because my puppy Shasta has passed away and I've got a lot going on, a little bit choked up. I really appreciate you guys watching and showing your support. Leave me a comment in the comment section letting me know why you liked or disliked this video. Definitely check back every Wednesday for news videos and gaming videos in between. Also check out my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash tyranny where I live stream my guild raids or other random stuff depending on how my raid turnout is. And other than that, I hope that everybody has a great rest of the week. And I will see you soon, okay? I love you all.